Hello and welcome back to Okami. I am Jimmy Joe and I am not sick anymore. We're headed towards the uh, the Yamato boat. Wait, wait, Amy. You know what'll happen if you cross the R Rainbow Bridge and board the Ark of Yamato, don't you? I mean, that boat is bad news. People of Kamui all know it. It's the most hated and feared thing in all the land. Even legends have nothing good to say about Lao Chi, uh, it or Lao Chai Lake. Lao Chi Lake? And you know there's no turning back once you're on board that thing, huh? You look like you want to say something. Resolve? You mean you've got the resolve to pass the point of no return? Do you have the resolve? Well, we don't really have any other choice. I see. Well, I guess this is it then. Amy, don't you go dying like you did a hundred years ago. It's alright, we have like two, uh... We have like four of those magic peaches or whatever that can resurrect us, so... And we haven't died once this game. Wait, wait a second, Amy. Um, well, we've been through a lot together, and I'm leaving you. <laughs> How long has it been since we first met? It all started in the valley of Sakuya's chest. Sakuya's chest. Don't you mean tree? <laughs> then we laid the smack down on Orochi, then that fox wench, and then Orochi again. We even went inside the Emperor's body, which was a little weird, but, you know, whatever, and traveled to the bottom of the sea. Then before I knew it, I found myself back in my own land. And now, it all ends with the appearance of the legendary Ark. But for you, it's just the start of an even greater adventure. Is it? Sorry, Amy. I'm breaking up with you. <laughs> I'm afraid this is where we say goodbye. Alright. As I told you from the beginning, I joined you so that I could steal those 13 brush techniques of yours. We found them all during our travels. And now, each and every one has been etched into my mind. It's not like I've mastered them yet, but I plan on having loads of fun with my newfound skills. It's a bit sad to see you go, but you gotta do what you gotta do. Take care of yourself, pal. No, Amy. Look. You're a god, I'm a sprite. We live in completely different worlds. The road ahead may be, tough, may be a tough one, but it's one you're just gonna have to walk alone. <laughs> I know, I know. It's just like, I got things I need to do, you know? Now let's wrap this up. I can't stand long goodbyes. Farewell, my furry friend. Boop, 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 boop. Hold it right there, furball. How many times do I have to tell you? We gotta go our separate ways. Now leave me alone, you thick-headed lump of fur. I have a feeling he's just gonna bite him and bring him along. He's right, Moshiri. Your way lies with this ark. I have giant stilts! You again! At last. At last, a path to the heavens has opened up. Oh, fantastic! How long have I yearned for this moment? Two hundred years? No, it must have been much longer. Bah, what are you babbling on about now, you big fruitcake? The path to the heavens? On that creepy old hunk of junk? What a fitting exit for a half-baked prophet like you. I have no idea what you're up to, and frankly, I don't care. I'm not part of this anymore, so I'm gonna split. Have fun, you two. Afraid of the legendary Ark, are we? 
I'm not afraid of anything. What did you just say? Well, if you must go, then go. Besides, only those worthy of the trip to the heavens may board the fabled Ark of Yamato. You never had a ticket, and you never will. Why, you witless two-bit half-baked prophet? You're just trying to take me on, trick me into going on that stupid boat. I'm not gonna fall for something like that. I'm no fool. So there. Wait a second. I know. Maybe I should just hop on board your little boat. Wait. What? Yeah. And then I should tear the place apart and a little parting gift for you. So you're gonna get on the boat anyway. Can't get on the boat. Got it. <laughs> Don't blame me. I already told you. Only those worthy of the trip to the heavens may board. But you didn't need me to tell you that, my little bouncing friend. You know very well why you can't board this ark. Do I not speak the truth, little celestial envoy? What? Well, it's about time. Ah! Bloop, bloop. Bloop, bloop. Well, looks like we're gonna be apart from a soon now. My little friend, I have another prophecy for you. Listen up, because this will no doubt come in handy for you. It takes two to tango. The bond of the brush shall intercede. Wow. I thought I'd give you the long version since it was my last. Pretty good, don't you think? Those unwilling to fulfill their own destiny cannot board the ferry to the celestial plane. Life is all about resolve. Outcome is secondary. It is resolve that determines the value of your life. You have no doubt met many such res resolute people in your journeys. Well, my little bouncing friend, I must bid you adieu. Shall we, ma chérie? We have a date with destiny, and we mustn't keep her waiting. Oh, he misses him already. of Yamato. Hello, little spirity dude. My goodness, I hardly believe it. My eyes may have been enveloped in darkness all this time, but I know when I see a divine being before me. Okami Apatrasu, you have returned home. I, Marco, would like to welcome you on behalf of all the Celestials. Celestial being Marco. Oh, I made a mistake. I said that you return home, but of course I was wrong. This is inside the dreaded Ark which fell from the heavens. It is nothing like our wonderful home, the Celestial Plane. Alas, only my spirit remains in this world. It's been imprisoned here for many years. Perhaps it was my destiny. Okami Amaterasu, I would be so grateful if you could bestow upon us a small gift. Not only for me, but for the others who succumb to death. In exchange, I will give you what I can. I'm sure it would lift everyone's spirits. Give an offering. What will you offer? Uh... 
demon fangs? Do I have demon fangs? Oh, I see. Okay, well, I guess we'll go. Oh, what's this? Uh, emits a holy tone that keeps demon scrolls at bay. Wood mat. Wounds to heal. Sure. I didn't realize he was actually like. It was an interesting way to make it a shop. Holy crap, I have a lot of money. Alright, let's see what, let's see if he actually has... Um, yes. And of money. I have nothing to sell, so buy... Whoa! Tundra beads. Those must be the... Ooh, gold dust. Yes. I won't want it. Want one of those? Um, I don't really care about those. I might as well buy this. I have enough. Bam! But all of my uh, all of my skills that I have learned is for glaives. So, all right. So this golden dust, I would like to put on this glaive here to make it even more powerful. It's so powerful now. All right. Save. <coughs> All right. Trials? Looks like trials. This looks like the nine-tailed fox. All right, let's go check out the nine-tailed fox. Dun, 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 dun. Hello. Goodness, if I'm not mistaken, you're from our home plane, the celestial plane. It's you, Okami Amaterasu. <coughs> Who would have thought you would meet after meet again after all this time? All my waiting in the under the dark, cold ice has paid off. We celestials may have lost our physical form, but our spirits live on, and we are with you for all eternity. Celestial being Hako, Hakuba. We were heartbroken after the battle in the Celestial Plane. When you fell to this world with that monster, we managed to escape before it happened, but little did we know the tragedy that was about to befall us. After we ran away from the battle, we boarded the Ark of Yamato, hoping to get away. But... Not long after we set sail, countless monsters appeared from the depths of the Ark. Having nowhere to run, all of us were devoured by the monsters. This Ark, which was built by the Lunar Civilization, turned out to be a cargo ship designed to transport thousands of monsters. Not long after setting sail, the Ark lost its rudder and plummeted to them to this world. The Celestials on board, each and every one of us, were slain. I don't know why the Moon Tribe built such a thing, but when the Ark fell to this world and brought us such tragedy, well, it was nothing short of a disaster. Okami Amaterasu. It seems that the Ark has begun to move again after all this time, but this place is like a nest of dark beings. Please take care not to be sucked into the darkness. You got it. All right. So, I have a feeling we're just gonna have to beat all the bosses again. Is that is that what's gonna happen here? We're gonna beat all the bosses and then we're gonna be done. Yeah. All right. All right. All right. All right. Okay. Which one was it? This one. All right. Let's see if I can remember it. There we go. I knew I had to wait for something. Where is he? Oh right, I have to beat these things.
Eh. tails or something. Nope. Nope. Wow! I thought I dodged it. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh, I forgot I have lightning on my back. That's that's dumb. That's dumb of me. Oh, come on! There we go. Oh, right. Okay. What's this? Oops. fast for you too fast for you oh I dodged it oh no I didn't okay ah that's not the one I wanted to get but I'll take it all right Oh, right. I have to electrify that one, I think. Now. Raise your thing. Just a normal fox now. What? Oh, right. I can kill it now. Ah, hey, hey, look how little health I have. Um, I forgot that I didn't have to hit him anymore. Okay, cool. One down. I just have to remember how to beat all of them. Where am I? Oh, I'm back in the other thing. Okay. Oh, there's nothing in there. Alright. Guess we'll take one at a time. Okami Amaterasu. It seems one of the dark beings has disappeared. If only all the evil power would have leaved our mists. And then I'm sure the Ark will return to the Celestial Plane. Ah, I was ready for immortality. Now it seems the time has come for my spirit to take leave. It's brought joy to my heart to have met you before I depart. I hope that you will return to the Celestial Plane, Amaterasu, and that you will bring light to this world once more. Goodbye! Alright. I guess we'll just take them in, take them in order. Oh look, it turned blue. This guy. Uh, I don't remember what this guy is supposed to do. I'm assuming there's going to be another spirit here. No, nope, there's no no spirit here. Maybe there's just one person to show us what's going on. Alright. I think I have to kill his armor, is what it is. Oh, 
Yeah, there we go. And then uh, I have to blow him out. Get him? Yeah. That one's easy. Spider. Oh, I'm gonna have to beat Orochi for a third time. Holy crap. Oh, there's another person. It's you, Amaterasu. I did wonder where, when the Ark began to move. Lo and behold, it is the guardian of our home, the Celestial Plane. Celestial being Sado. Why did such a tragedy befall us? This Ark was built on the Lunar Civilization as a rescue boat. I had been enshrined in the Celestial Plane for many years. We believed it would be safe. In order to ensure the future existence, we fled to the Ark when the monsters attacked us. How could we have known that this Ark would become a coffin? I don't know. Maybe it was our destiny, perhaps. It was all decided from the start. More lore! The monster Orochi, who attacked the Celestial Plane, had suddenly come flying across the Sea of Stars. And after destroying our people and our homeland, it went on to cause pain and suffering in this world. Perhaps, perhaps it was preordained by the Moon Tribe. Perhaps? We'll never know. Or will we? I don't know. Maybe it'll tell us. Okay, I remember this one. Come on. Almost. That's fine. This is fine. Everything is fine. Sticky butt up in the air. Sticky butt up in the air. There we go. One. And two. And three. Almost dead. Come on, you could put me at least a little further away. Yep. Keep jumping. Nope. None of that. Okay. One. Two. And three. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Three. And... 
dead. Nice. We're breezing through these things. And it's gonna say something? What do you have to say? Okami Amaterasu. I sense the presence of someone here on the Ark. Could it be that that man from the Moon Tribe? I feel his pain somewhere deep inside the Ark. You mean Waku? Ah, uh, Amaterasu, you must save him without a moment's delay. You must stop the seeds of tragedy from being sown. In order for the evil in this world to be exercised, the sun god Amaterasu must return to the celestial plane. I pray that you will watch over the world from the heavens and that you will bestow peace upon us all. <coughs> Man, they can tort in really weird ways. Like, looks awful the way that they, like, die and stuff. I'm assuming this is Orochi. It looked like it from the, uh, the picture. Yep, it is. Alright, so there's no setup at least. Just gotta wait for him to do his thing and then roar. Let's see if we can activate both of these. Oh, I have to, yeah, yeah, I have to go up him and take out his bell, right? Come on. Oh, really? Alright, cool. I didn't have to go do too many of those. I really just have to hit it once. There we go. Alright. I do like this fight. The mechanics are pretty cool, but, you know, this is the third time I've had to do this in the same game. Like, I feel, I feel like they just overused this just a little bit. I mean, it was nice storytelling with, like, going back in time and whatnot, but, come on, come on, come on, come on, ah! Okay, good. I didn't have to go through the timed event. Ugh, I hated that part. Not too bad. Why are we getting so much money? It's the end of the game. I find it interesting that we only got one talisman. Like, these things, the holy artifact things, there's three slots for them. You'd think you'd find more, unless this game is a lot longer than I think it is. Because I think I'm nearing the end, but I could be completely wrong. 
I have been waiting for you, Okami Amaterasu. My fleeting spirit would disappear at any moment. I'm glad I was able to hold on long enough to meet you. Azumi. Long ago, you and Orochi fell together to this world, and you waited for the Chosen One to put an end to Orochi's life. You waited plentifully for countless moons, until finally the Chosen One, Nagi, was born. Together, you sent the monster of the moon to its fate. You didn't realize it, but that was just one ripple in the wave of darkness. It's exactly a hundred years since the legend of Nagi. The monster was quietly recovering its strength for all those years, until it used Nagi's descendant Suzano to complete its revival. And once again, it tried to destroy the world. When you defeated it, the next stage of the plan began, and the cursed with the land it cursed the land with its evil power. And the world was soon overrun with monsters from the Ark. Orochi's evil essence was more than enough to power them all. The smoldering powers of darkness exploded throughout Nippon. Nippon? And the world was thrown into a storm of chaos never seen before. After that, well, you saw with your own eyes. The evil powers left those monsters you defeated and have all gathered here in the Ark of Yamato. Exorcism of the roots of evil in dark is, is a daunting task. You must keep your eyes open for what's in the center of it all. In the center of it all, eh? Well, we are currently getting rid of evil spirits to go to the center of whatever this arc is. This guy. How do I deal with this guy again? Okay, it's not that. Ah, yes! Flying swords! Okay, okay, okay. Um... I have to wait until he, uh, he does the thing. Stab. So, I will run around in a circle and dodge. And dodge. And dodge. 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 Okay. Come on. Swords. Dodge. Dodge. Aww. Dodge. 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 Alright. Oh, okay. Um. Oh, that's stupid. I can't. I can't actually, like. You know what? I have little ones. Um, I can't fully kill it in one go because of game coding. <laughs> Ow. Oh. No. And die. Okay. Nice. That was probably the worst one of them all that I've done so far. My worst performance. What do I have? One more left? Nope, that, that's it. Cool. Okami Amaterasu. It has begun long last. The waves of darkness have finally begun to roll. All this evil power, I cannot hold on much longer. Amaterasu, is there? There is one final thing I must tell you. The man of the moon tribe with the golden hair. I want you to tell him something. The celestials will never forget how he fought alongside you when Orochi attacked. We are forever grateful. 
So Waka was useful and not a complete douchebag. That's nice to know. Alright. Oh. I can level up. Maybe. Yes. Uh, like, any of this really matters anymore, though. Ta-da! Like I said, I could be completely wrong, and this game is, like, another 20 hours, but... Okamiya Matarasu. Just being able to see you with my own eyes, I can tell you how much joy it brings me. It pains me that I can't remain with you until the end, but I know that you won't let us down. Now I must join the others, but I'll never forget you and how you, you we used to play in the fields in our homeland. I pray that you will always shine bright, Amaterasu. And more contorting and dying. Are we ascending to the heavens now? Oh, well, there's Waka. There you are, Amaterasu. I thought I could handle this before you arrived, but it seems I have met my match. <laughs> this brings you brings back memories, Machete. Remember when we faced Orochi together on the celestial plane? Behold, it is shrouded in darkness, but make no mistake, this is none other than Yami, the evil ruler of darkness. It was he who slew the Celestials on board this very Ark, and brought misfortune upon the land of mortals. Of course, it's too dark to see his true form now. And so it begins. The dreaded day of darkness is upon us. That's okay, I can put a sun in the sky. Right? Right? Right. Maybe. Or he'll just cover up the sun. That's fine. Oh, look, all the constellations. That's got to be uh, useful, right? <gasps> Yami, the big giant orb! Will he hatch into something, or will he just be a giant orb? Find out now! On Chimichou Gaming! What the? Oh, those are all the brush strokes! No! No, how am I supposed to beat him without the brush strokes? Or are those the orbs? I think those are the breaststrokes. <gasps> no! Distorted time and space brings about this phenomenon. This ill-fated day only occurs once every hundred years. Nobody, not even the gods, has the power to stop it. I'm an orb! So mad. I am so mad. So mad. Uh Tiny Manatee? Tiny Manatee Driver. Tiny Manatee Laser. Pew pew. Still, I shall stand firm and fight this battle. For it is I who brought the Ark of Yamato to the Celestial Plane, but I was oblivious to the evil that lurked within its depths. I caused the death of countless innocent Celestials, and brought us a curse upon the land of mortals. However, I cannot re reset my actions nor undo the past. Manatee 
beam too strong for sword walk as a woman maybe Amaterasu Orochi can only be defeated with the power of the chosen one that's what I told you and you waited for waited for me without question you waited patiently in this land of mortals you waited for the day that Nagi the Chosen One was born you believed in me despite knowing that I counted myself among the ranks of the accursed moon tribe who had escaped from the lunar realm I was deeply moved by your earnest spirit that is why my faith in you has not waned since that fateful day when we engaged Orochi in battle side by side. Manatee Beam! Amaterasu, you must return to the celestial plane. You must do so in order to bring peace to this world. Oh, Manatee Beam! Well, he did. She dead? It's dead. I don't understand why if we don't have ink, then we don't have our weapons. Because the weapons are a separate item. I don't know why we can't use our weapons. Well, I can... I can fight it. Wait, 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 wait. I wonder if I can... Yes? Alright. Sick. I got one thing back. Which one is that? You retrieved rejuvenation. Okay, so I can... I can shoop shoop this back to the way it was. Ah! Um, yeah, I don't have cut anymore. That's right. Is that one cut? Or slash? See, power slash. All right, cool. And just in time to power slash him. Oh, crap. So, I'm going to have to rejuvenate this thingy. Whoa! Okay. Okay. Ouch. Nope. That... Ouch. Part of me wants to die just so that I can see what happens to the revival thing. Yeah, let's get this all back in order, thank you. Alright, so we got another one. Which one are we going to be able to use now? We received... Oh, crap. Oh, okay. Well. Oh. Alright, cool. That can't be it, though. What am I missing? Oh, there's another orb. Okay. I don't have water yet. 
Ow. Ow. How am I supposed to... Okay. This is water? Because there's fountains? Received cherry bomb. Okay, so I have to open him and then put a cherry bomb in him? Oh, okay. Um, can I put one in there? Nope, that didn't work. Come on! Alright, well, fire things. Alright. I can finally dodge correctly! Can I hit it? Kind of. I don't know what the cherry bomb's gonna be for. Maybe I just didn't need to use the cherry bomb. I figured as I got them back, I would have to use them all. Water spout. Okay, so now I can get rid of the fire. Uh, what? Alright, this makes it a little bit easier. Come on! What, are, what am I getting now? Crescent. So, the moon? Alright. Can I, can I put something in here to make it... Oh! Oh! Okay, 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 okay. I get it now, kind of. Come on, climb, 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 climb. Weakness, yay, okay, cool. All right. Ice one. Can I... Am I supposed to... Oh, I don't have the slow time yet thing yet. Wait, what? Oh, right. I just wanted to see what happened, like how how it worked. Okay, well. Um I don't have the fire one yet. Ooh, I got something.
Gale Storm. Oh, there's the wind, right? There we go. Cool. Mm, ow. How am I supposed to... Okay. This is really difficult. I don't know exactly what I'm supposed to be doing. What the hell? Ow! Ow! Cool. I just have to be really lucky. This is so tedious. <laughs> How many do I have now? And what is this one? Veil of the Mist. I don't even remember what Veil of the Mist is. Oh, I know what it is. It's this one. Yeah. Infinity Stone. Well, that's not what I wanted. know what I must do now. Oh, come on! Did it! Okay, that's that orb down. What's next? 
Lightning orb. Lightning orb. Okay. Weird. Alright, what's this mechanic? I don't have ice yet. Uh, what? What? Okay, well, that's something. Ow. Okay. <coughs> I keep being able to get its weak point, but I'm not doing too much damage to it. Catwalk? What the hell am I going to use Catwalk for? Oh, uh, oh, 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 uh, lightning, 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 I don't have lightning yet. Oh, crap. Can I have, <laughs> thank you. Can I please have the camera back? I know you're trying to be helpful, but holy crap. Really? That's all there is? Ow. Why do I need that? Ow! Oh, come on! Ah, oh, every time it opens, I don't have enough time to hit it! Oh, crap. Can I just slash it? No. Is that... Okay. Oh, I think this is one of the, the most annoying balls so far. What is this one? Is this the lightning one? I could really use the lightning one. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, next one. I must have almost all of them by now. Blizzard. Okay, okay, okay. So now I can do this. Can I slash him? No, I can't. Oh, but it's open. Okay. Cute, which should there we go. Come on, kill it before it goes back in. No, all right. Uh, all right, it's never done that before. Oh, come on, camera, work with me. Ow. 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 Can I just... No, I can't. Ugh. Can you just... die already? Thank you. Oh, is that the end? Is that the last orb? <laughs> nice. 
Not half bad for a ball. Well, you know the drill. Let's have one of those famous howls of yours. Wait, was he supposed to come back? I'm very confused. Did I just miss something in the cutscene? Oh no, he's just not there. Oh. It was a lie. We weren't. We weren't victorious at all. What's going on? What? Is this the real thing? But we don't have any brush strokes anymore. We're gonna have to collect them again. Ugh. Bah! That furball is always spacing out like that. Amy can't get anything done without my help. Huh? Is that doggy crying somewhere, sis? Is that why the sunshine has disappeared? Sob. I haven't seen the doggy for a while now. Did my saying there's no such thing as gods cause all this? Snowy, they're the whole digging dog, the, the whole digging king. I never dreamt that you were god. You're gonna make Ayabusa a nervous wreck if you don't get that sun shining again soon. Amaterasu, thank you. We can protect our village by ourselves. But you must be strong and triumphant over evil. For the canine warriors so dearly wish to see you once more. Mm, the god sure was burning passion. Burning with a passion. I don't know what happened, but uh, if a mongrel doesn't come out of hiding, I'll have to send up a really big one to reignite his passion. Oh, so the wolf was really a god. Perhaps I should have made an offering of my bamboo ware. It may be my fault that the sun has ceased to shine. Mr. Orange, who would have, who, who would have ever thought that that rascal was really sure on you when you were born? My, my, how would God love my cherry cakes? Could this darkness be cause of my hunger? Chirp. Uh-oh, uh, the boss is praying. Snowy, did something happen to you? Why has the sun suddenly disappeared? Fido, won't roll over and play dead for evil. No brother of mine would dream of it. <laughs> Something in your brushwork touches the heart as soon. You never abandon your life as an artist after all. When one tires to master something, one tries to master something, it ends in either success or failure. But it isn't the attempt itself where you find your true value. Believe in your own power and walk your own path. As soon, I see you have finally heeded your calling. Your resolve is plain to see in your drawing. It has the power to move people's hearts and inspire their faith in gods. Amaterasu, their faith shall be your power. Ha ha ha! He did it! Uh, my grandson did it! Look at those spirits behind the, the behind this beautiful brushwork. He truly deserves a title of Celestial Envoy. His work like this can show the true glory of the gods and the guide the people to the right path. There's one thing I'm sure of, Amaterasu. You found a much better companion than I could ever be. Okay, everyone. I know it's kind of hard to see in this darkness, but uh, get a load of my la latest work. This soon, Wandering Artist presents his interpretation of the great god Amaterasu. Can you hear me, Amy? 
You're not floundering without me, are you? You gotta pull yourself together. I finally chose my path, and I have resolved to see it through. I've started to roam the land as your missionary. But you gotta take care of things on your end, too. Don't look so sad. Just psych yourself up like we always did, remember? Oops, I almost forgot. Check out these, everyone. <laughs> wow. Uh, it's great god Amaterasu descending from the heavens. Pretty good, huh? Amy was smiling down from the sky just a little while ago. Something must have disturbed the furball's concentration, though. That's why the world has gone dark. Without Amy, we can't take a refreshing nap outdoors. Rice won't grow. Plants and flowers will wither. Laundry won't ever dry. Monsters will roam about like they own the place. In other words, our world will be a total mess. No one wants to live in a world like that. Especially me. So come on, everybody. Let's join together and call upon the great God. Let's show Amy that we truly believe. Put your hands together and pray. Clap if you believe in our fairy Amaterasu. <laughs> Let's make our gratitude obvious. I mean, we, should, we shouldn't pray only when we want something. We should consider how the gods must feel once in a while. We should even take on some of their burden. If you pray with all your heart, maybe the sun will cheer up and show itself once again, lighting our world with its heavenly glow. After all, the best thing about the great god Amaterasu is that he, that happy-go-lucky spirit. Right, Amy? Answer if you can hear me, you big furball. It's so sad. Look at all the embodiments of clapping. The brush strokes and constellations are back. I think my favorite god was the mochi bunny. Bunny with a giant hammer. Look, the sun came out again. We look different. All right, time to fight. Oh, jeez, those are fast. Ow, 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 ow. Okay, okay, okay. What is this? Oh, these are the, uh... Those are the cat statues. I don't need the cat statues, I don't think. I need to figure out what I need to do to... Oh, oh. Ow. What do I need to do? Ooh. I'm sure our prayers have reached Amy. I know that no matter how dark it gets, there's no... When that... I can't read and fight at the same time! I need... something. What do I do? What do I... Okay, do I, am I supposed to climb up here? Wait, why... Why didn't this work? Uh, turn around, turn around, turn around, turn around, turn around. Why can't I turn around? Ow. Ah, this is stupid. This is stupid. I can't move. Why can't I move? Get off the pill. Come on. Is there... 
What? What? What am I supposed to do? All I'm doing is dying. And I can't. I can't see what's going on because. It, okay. Oh. Come on, move. Oh, come on! I guess it should. I, I couldn't read what the thing was. Ha what what thing was? Yeah, the thing. Ugh. I hate this. I hate not being able to express what I'm trying to say. Um, it was probably telling me that I needed sun to see in the darkness. And blah blah blah. What the heck? I can't. What? Ah! Stop it! I can't see anything. Uh. No. Why? What am I even supposed to be doing? What? Okay, so I have to wait for it to get quiet or dark or something, and then I have to... Okay, well, how do I make it dark? Maybe I can put a moon... Oh, come on! I didn't even see that happen! Because the camera... Why, why can't I... Why, why can't I... Thank you. I understand the camera's trying to keep it in front of me, but... Oh, crap! Was I too late? Nope. Whoa. What was the... What was the Susano thing? I, I don't know why Susano was in there. And let's just do this one more time, just to make sure. Ow. I wish I could actually see these stupid things. It's not letting... Okay. Now that it's dark again. Eh, 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 eh. Okay. Do I have one of those charms? Traveler's charm? Yeah, let's, let's try that. See if that helps. It probably does. in time. That one wasn't. I don't think I can... No, I don't think... I don't... I don't care about these. I don't care about these. Come on.
Oh. I know it's not as fun when it's something as painfully obvious of what you're supposed to do for a fight, but when you try almost everything you can think of, and you still can't get it. I mean, it's nice that it gave me a hint to bring out the sun because it was dark. But it was really annoying that Asun was trying to talk while I was trying to figure it out, even though he was trying to tell me what to do. Hey, there's Waka, and she's got a flying saucer? What a long and whining word it's been, eh, hey, Mash Shitty? But at last, our arch nemesis Yami, the Dark Lord, who brought darkness, the Dark Lord who brought darkness upon the land of mortals has been annihilated for all eternity. I must say, I was really surprised by your little bouncing friend. You couldn't have done it without him. Ha 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 that tickles. Down, heal, you're going to lick me to death. Well, Amaterasu, time to embark through an even stormier seas. Making the world a better place is never easy. But you must return to the celestial plane and set things in order. Only then can you usher in a new age of peace in the mortal world. Our journey is far from over, Mashari. What? That's very sci-fi. Now, full speed ahead! First stop, the Celestial Plane! Oh, I see. We were in the arc and then... Okay, okay, okay. So basically, you were able to see all around you, even from in the arc. From within the arc. The path to the heavens, eh? <laughs> it kinda sounds like fun. You remember what I said the first time I met you, Ahemi? There's no stopping me once I've made a decision. So I'm going, Furball, and there's no way you're gonna stop me. I'm gonna pull out all the stops and inspire people's faith in you. You're gonna have more believers than you know what to do with. You'll see. Until then, take care of yourself, you big furball. The end? The end? Or is there a whole nother part of the game on uh, the Celestial Plane? I have a feeling that's the end, though. Yay! We did it! That was cool. Um... Yeah, some of the fights were frustrating, but once you've got the mechanics for each fight, I mean, it wasn't too hard. Like, there are some games that you play that, even if you know the mechanics, it, it's hard to get the timing down and stuff. But, yeah, um, I enjoyed that game. It took approximately 30 hours, and uh, if you've sat through all of it, then I hope you really enjoyed the story, too. Um... Yeah, I'll uh, let the credits go all the way through because I feel like they're deserved, and uh, we'll see what, uh, what what I have time to play next. We'll see you next time. See what I'm playing.
Who knows? All right. I'll leave you with the credits. Have a good one. See you next week or next time on Shimmy Joe Gaming. I'm out. Bye. Later. Yeah,
Thank <laughs> you. 